This time of year, students across Central Georgia are putting on their caps and gowns, getting their diplomas, and heading out into the real world. That means more financial responsibility. Sarah Hammond sat down with a financial advisor who offers up some tips for success and some pitfalls to avoid, including advice you can use even if your career started years ago. It's a season of celebration in Central Georgia. I'm just so excited we get to move on to the next chapter of our lives. College graduates are headed out into the real world. It's great to just to finally walk the stage and get to put our mark out on the world. And all of that means more financial responsibilities, like building up your savings account, investing in a 401k, keeping tabs on your credit score, and paying off that student debt. It sounds like a lot. But Rebecca Wilton with the Rosenberg Financial Group says there's no need to feel overwhelmed. Be open to change, be patient, and just keep moving forward. Wilton says opening a savings account and investing in your company's 401k are great places to start because it's never too early to start saving for retirement. And the money you invest early will grow the most because it has more time to work for you. Start saving for, you know, moving out or, you know, even your future, whatever that might look like. And um, again, whatever your company might offer, if they have 401ks, you want to always do the match amount because that is free money that they're giving to you. As for your credit score, she says you've got to keep an eye on it because that could drive up costs in the future or prevent you from getting a loan. Um, the, the bulk of it is by on-time payments and then length of your credit history and just making sure that you don't have any collection bills or any, you know, unpaid bills. One thing on the minds of many recent grads is paying off that student debt. Making a plan and a budget so that you know what you have to pay. You want to definitely take care of your rent and your utilities, those things first, but you want to pay as much extra as you can to that student debt to get it paid down. Wilton and says avoiding big purchases when you're just starting out will also help keep your budget in check and prevent you from getting yourself into a hole you can't get out of. In Macon, Sarah Hammond, 13 WMAZ News. And these tips aren't just for the class of 2021. Wilton says it's never too late to start saving. And we'll have more financial advice in this story on our website, 13WMAZ.com.